All right, if you ever need to return a large item back to Amazon, this is the process. So they got movers here in this big semi truck. They just place down the ramp. You don't even have to repackage it. I did more work than I needed to. The cardboard stays. And it's just a, a base component of the box. Oh, let me move this out of the way for you. There you go. So there are some small components like uh, cables. Yeah. So. Yeah. Man, that's huge. Look at that. That's a lot of space back there. Like from the outside, it doesn't look that big, but you can actually live in here. Set up your living room and the bathroom in here. I'm pretty sure there are people who actually do that. They live in the, uh, the, the trailer, the truck. All right, so as you just witnessed, they, the moving people, or not the moving people, but the pickup people just came and took away the chair itself. They did not take the packaging material with them. And that is something I did not know. I was trying for about 20 minutes uh, uh, two nights ago to try to repackage the chair back into the the, the, the cardboard and fitting all these uh, supporting pieces down here back into the box and that was um, something that was needless because I didn't need to do that so so I just want to I want to share with you a few things about sh uh, returning such an expensive and large item from Amazon so first of all you you can't just drop it off at the nearest um, UPS store because that's what I've done with some of the smaller items I've ordered uh, and had to return. With this one here, you have to ha have a service come and pick it up from you because it weighs 200 pounds. And so, yeah, it, it will be quite a logistical challenge to get this uh, back to a warehouse uh, yourself, for example. And number two, uh, it's going to cost you $50. At least it cost me fifty dollars for this two thousand dollar chair, and I believe that's a restocking fee. So they'll refund everything that you paid, including the tax uh, amount, but minus fifty dollars. They won't refund you that amount minus uh, or they won't uh, they won't refund you the fifty dollars because they take that and they probably use that towards the the compensation for these uh, these people. Who, who just came and picked pick that up. And uh, obviously, as you can see here with the, the cardboard and there's some plywood in the back there, they don't want you and they, they actually, uh, they don't need you and they don't want you to repackage the thing. They want the, the, the item exposed. So uh, I, I was dumb, I didn't have to do all this work. Uh, now my, my, big, my big challenge now is you know, how to dispose of all this. And I think I'm just gonna do it gradually by breaking down the cardboard into small pieces and gradually uh, stuffing stuffing them into the uh, recycling bin. But yeah, um, it was a tough decision to return this chair because I think it's a really good chair for its price, its price point at $2,000. It does uh, most of what I want. It has the 3D body scan uh, technology it has it does zero zero gravity uh, inversion it has uh, airbag uh, massaging it has a, a set of four rollers on a platform that travels along an s track it it looks beautiful I mean I think this chair looks looks uh, more pleasing than some of the higher price chairs at five thousand dollars even seven thousand dollars this is a good-looking chair especially with the therapeutic mood mood LED lighting on the side um, it's got it's got the Bluetooth the Bluetooth connectivity 
it's got most of the features of the very expensive chairs but it just doesn't have all the functionality that i want because um i went and did a little bit more research and i I came to the conclusion that I want more from a chair. I'm, I don't want to compromise with this chair. There, there are certain elements in life. There are certain aspects of in life I am willing to compromise on. Like my car, for instance. I don't need a Lucid Air uh, premium version. To me personally, that would be the, the best car on the market right now, That uh, the best sedan that you can buy. Oh, well, actually, it's not available now. But if uh, if when it when it does become available later this year, that would be the best car, even better than a Tesla Model S, the Lucid Air uh, Premium, the one that that's the top of the line. I think it goes for one hundred seventy seventy something thousand dollars. But personally, that would be no compromise. But if you buy any other car on the market, whether you buy a Corolla, a Camry, uh, even luxury cars like a Cadillac or Mercedes, you'd be you'd be compromised. Are compromising on the car so I I didn't want to do that and like, like I said I'm willing to compromise on car I'm willing to compromise on food I'm willing to compromise on a lot of things but not massage chair and I don't don't ask me why I came I, I suddenly decided this is this is one aspect of, of uh, our one aspect of life or one consumer item that I just suddenly spontaneous spontaneously decided I'm not gonna compromise on. I don't know why, but I have just this strong wave of conviction just flowing all over me. Like, don't compromise on your freaking chair. So that's what I'm doing. I'm not compromising. I'm getting the best chair that's available on the market. Are you, technically the the third best chair, but the two best chairs on the market they're exorbitantly expensive, excessively expensive. I mean the. The most expensive chair in the market now is a Lamborghini chair, thirty thousand um, dollars. But this is the third one, and it goes for about twelve thousand dollars. But I will not be paying for I will not be paying twelve thousand dollars. I'm gonna reveal to you how much I am gonna that how much I paid for it. It's actually already ordered. But this chair, the Daiwa Supreme Hybrid, and I, I bought it under a different brand, but it's the same exact chair, the same exact functionality, the same exact. Uh, material, um, even the same color. It's just it's just under a different brand, but it does everything that I want. It it looks it looks gorgeous. Number one, it's got Bluetooth connectivity, just like this one. It has all the function out of this one. It just it takes it to a whole nother dimension. Uh, the the leg rest or the the calf massage. It it has a kneading function. On to, uh, for the back of your your calves, one it has it has heating elements for your your legs. This one does not have heating elements for your legs. It has just the heating for the lumbar. That one, um, it's got so much more. But okay, so I off the top of my mind, I might not be able to come up with uh, just on the spot all the all its functionality. But the hip, so it has hip airbags. So your your hips getting uh, swayed left and right. It's got two sets. This is the, the, the big selling point. It's got two sets of rollers on two independent platforms traveling along the the L track. So it goes all the way from your, your, your neck, the back of your neck, all the way down to the back of your thighs or your what your your quads, your quadriceps. And you can have multiple body parts stimulated at the same time. Uh, it's got I believe it's got 50 individual air cells. Um, and it's a lot of uh, there's a lot of uh, there's a lot of things that it does so much better. Uh, I'm gonna <clears throat> I can't think of those off the top of my, my mind. Uh, the main ones being the ones I just mentioned. But stay tuned. I'm gonna introduce you to the third best massage chair and the one that I consider no compromise for myself in a upcoming video. Okay, stay tuned.